want to get you to pull out your phones, turn on your torches and wave them around as a thank you to these race drivers here tonight. So grab your phones, get the cameras out, get the torches turned on and wave them around and make some noise for the 2023 production sedan Rum City Rumble Field. <laughs> Come on, turn one, get those torches turned on and wave them high in the sky. While the bar, come on, turn for the bar, get them flash and get them up. The drivers can see it and they appreciate the support. Here we go, back straight away, it's on you. Oh, how good is this song? Turn three and four, don't disappoint us now, get them up, wave them around. The final lap before we go green, getting transport. The Wide Bay Hydraulics is the FE Falcon of Neil Cowdulls out of position number six. From Geelong, Victoria, Stewie Robertson out of P7 with Gimpy's Hayden Turner alongside of him. Then it's going to be the Miramar 17 of Reed with TJ Horn, your top 10, as the lights go out and the Rum City Rumble is green! As they go side by side down into the first turns, one and two, it's side by side action. It's three wide as they go down the back. Oh, it's hooked! Trav Hutchinson got hooked from Corey Jennings as they went three wide. And a bunch of race cars going for the same but real estate. And I tell you what, I think Brad Shear would like to have that restart again. And Jennings comes. Yeah, you've got to be careful not to do something silly here. Yeah, he just made it through. Travis Hutchinson coming in to get his car checked over as well. Just having a quick look over. Um, Jennings' car and Hutcho's car. Don't want to lose those two. Here, um, our other official over the far side making comment. So um, we have to have eyes in other places, and he confirmed what was the first call. Well, there you go. Watch the back. Richie Cook, Matt Nelson, Corey Jennings in the room. Out front, we go green. And the bottom line, not proving the place to be, is the outside looks strong as Jarius with a run through turn two. This time we survive the first two corners in the back straight away. They're all scuffled all over the place. Richie Cook making moves. Sign. Up a couple of positions, but Josh Jarius leads up number one. And Shearer goes to the top. It pitches it down the back straight away with a good run. Oh, good diamond cut up into the centre. But uh, Jarius said, no, you're not going under there. So. Oh, Boucher crossed up. Contact with Grundy. On the back straight away, the 55 with the big tank slide for Grundy with the way to go, make contact. Both cars won't have to end this time, but a long back and guaranteed to be damaged. Jarius leads from Shearer and Hutchinson, your top three, Cal Dulles and Ingham. The next two with Turner on the outside of the top five. Robertson and Reid battling it out for seventh and eighth with TJ Horn just getting involved in that battle as well. And again, Brad Shearer up the inside, down the back shoot they go. He's going to make a statement here. He wants to take back that number one spot. Side oh. by side, he nearly had it sideways. Woo. Take it, friend, Brad Shearer. Race to go. He really wants that pole. He likes to lead around here. His preferred line is that diamond off the corner, as you said, Terry. And when the car's behind, it's just so hard to do that. It, when you dive in the top of the track, it leaves you vulnerable. Here we are, Brad Shearer, once again, through turns one and two. 
side this time with really good run. It gets to the pillar. Side by side into turn three. The Jarius around the outside looking strong. Stu's going to have a crack again for that top line. So, so good, Terry. Yeah, the crap is definitely up on that top line. So, uh, that crap again is start coming into play here very shortly. So, Travis was sticking his nose under Brad Shearer then as they went down into the number two corner. But as they go into three and four, they're getting lap traffic now in front of them. Here we go. This is on. It's on MT. This Tanya Matthews does a great job getting out of the way. Gary Bowden retires the 55 with radiator leak of some sort. And here, once again, in the turn three this time, Shearer going to diamond off the top of the corner. Hit a good run down the front straight away. But Jarius, too good on the exit. How good is this? This is what you call great production sedan racing, and this field is on. Travis Hutchins has just dropped back a bit, but our front two are showing a clean pair of heels to the rest of the field. And the lap traffic is going to make a massive difference. Once it gets further back here, look at this. Corey Jennings in the 46, still right at the back. Matt Nelson is as well. Richard Cook made a few moves in order. So Cook, well, well inside the tent now. Uh, like Christensen, the 22, running strong as well. So out front, Jar is still leading the way from Brad Shearer. Rick Cook smoking like crazy. On the glass of 15. Three wide down the back chute. Oh, past the lap car of Jada McKay. Jara is still leading this one. Jira. Hammer and Tom on the back of the Maribor 3. Richie Cook causing a smoke screen throughout the field. And this is unbelievable. Where do you look, Terry? Battles happening absolutely everywhere. Sam Grundy might be retiring the Mer 16. Shearer has a crack once again. Goes to the outside now, Shearer. This is going to be his best chance in a long time. He'll come back down. He just can't get a good enough exit. DJ Leonard's out. The Rock Hamden 18, the green machine. Pulls onto the infield out of this race. Jarius still leads the way. And Travis Hutchinson in the mix in this one. It's a free car battle for the lead. Josh Jarius leading the way. Brad Shearer hot on his bumper. Diamonds off the corner again. This is a good exit. It's a great exit. Long side. Brad Shearer going to send it to turn number one with a slide job. What a move Brad Shearer. Jarius fights back to the inside. But Brad Shearer around the top. He's gone across the line. We need to put one more lap in the ball. In. And Brad Shearer leads his first lap of this feature race. Jarius back at Nickman Hutchinson. There's three pulls it in. Brandon Jarius pulls a 33 in out of the race. And Brad Shearer back to the top, diving off the corner, trying to pull away from the field. You're one around. Darren Reed, the Maribor 17, rotates. And we will have a yellow. As does Jaden McKay in the front straight away. As well, he's backwards. Holy dooly. What a race we're witnessing here. 14 left to go. We just passed the halfway distance. Brad Shearer takes the lead. Front. Maribara 3 was on song. And a drive shaft for DJ Lennon, he suspects, after smacking the wall. Ended his race. And engine drummers for the 33. The lights go out. 14 down. We've still got plenty to go. Brad Shearer leads him and pulls a good gap. Hutchinson goes to the inside of Jarius for second. Side by side, it's a drag race in the back straight away. Jarius going to get the exit off the top. Goes to the outside once again. He didn't keep it going, he doesn't. He gets a bit of a push. But Hutchinson got crossed up. And Jarius holds on to second now. Here comes Killer Cowdoulis. The old
Oh, Wally Old Dog, uh, Cal Duras, he certainly knows his way around here at Carina and he's... Oh, spotting. Terry, three wide further oh, back! Look at that! Stewie Robinson on the outside, Ingham on the middle, Reedy through the, the bottom and oh, Ingham gets a cross up! This is unbelievable racing, Matt Nelson now, climbing through the order! And Cal Duras now on the inside of Hutchinson, he got a terrible exit at turn two! Count Dulles well on the inside of the Mustang. And Count Dulles takes third spot. So you're top five right now. Brad Shearer leading the way. And we've got half a straightaway lead to the three of Jarrett. There he has Count Dulles right behind him. Hutchinson in fourth has turned it to his inside now. Nelson making it all the way up to seven spots so far, so he's making good inroads on our leaders. He's doing a great job right now, the Victoria 61. Who's Kilpatrick from Geelong? The 36 is two. The next one ahead of him. And I'll tell you what, he'll be wanting a yellow. I can guarantee that. To try and close back in on this battle. Left to go, ten left to go. Ten laps remaining. Put Brad Shearer for two thousand dollars. He's got a good gap back to second place of Josh Jarius. Who starts to pull away from Count Dulles, Hutchinson and Turner. They spread themselves out. Shearer approaching the Butterberg 72 of McKay. The lap car, he's put about two laps between him and seconds. And a handful laps remaining. He's going to just keep running consistent times. Get the car to the finish. Then hold on for what's been a fantastic weekend. this battle for the podium yet. He's got to the back bumper of Jarius. He's got Jaden McKay. The lap car ahead of him. And Jarius sends it straight to the inside. Count Dulles will go with him as well. So he got two car lengths. Second and third. And Hutchinson gets past as well. Who's dropped a bit. The Mustang's trailing a little bit of smoke out the back. Threw it up in one and two, so... He was so quick after that restart, and it's just as a man to match the cars ahead of him. But Matt Nelson's still there. Stewie Robertson probably closing in on that top five battle as well. But we stay green on the racetrack. Five left to run. Five laps remaining here. And Brad Nira putting on a clinic so far this weekend. Matt Nelson, that car is awesome. Shoot the flame out the left hand side exhaust. Jarius Count Dawson and Hutchinson do battle for second, third, and fourth. Hutchinson's caught back up. He goes upstairs into turn three, dimes off the corner. The sheer one. And there's a lap car ahead of Jarius. Bianca Cook. And then Hutchinson goes to the outside of Count Dawson. Three one. He wants that exit off the corner. Drag race and train has the door shut in his face. What a battle still raging. For second, third, and fourth. Hutchinson wants to get in the top three. And finish on the podium. He's gonna have to drive the wheels off that Mustang. Get FG Falcon. With one lap left to go. The Thunderbird 30. Oh, oh, that car out the shed. No more than a month ago. And since then, has been flawless as Brad Shearer wins the Rums. The Rum. Oh! Have a look at this top corner as they come around. This is going to be a melee. The second place now, Cal Dulles takes it off. Jarry's in the line. Jarry's looking to settle for third. Hutchinson home in fourth, they had a Turner, Robinson, Nelson, Christensen, Jennings. Right. 
Belgian sedan racing at its finest. And Brad Shearer puts another cool $2,000. That is one of the best feature races I've seen in a long time. That was great driving from our field and the couple of cars that pulled out, but we still had a huge number to finish the race, and that is great to see and fantastic for Brad Shearer to take a win here at home once again. Um, hey, come on, Shearer. Some donuts in front of the fans in turn four. <laughs> family and fans up there, big time. Absolutely awesome. Congratulations, that was one heck of a feature race. And it wasn't easy, but a cool, another $2,000. Oh, that's bloody beautiful. Um, yeah, Josh gave us a bloody awesome race then. Credit to him. Um, yeah. That track was awesome then. Um, yeah, I've got to thank the cheer squad over here in turn three and four. Uh, Mum, Paige, Belinda Hayden, Annabelle Roxon, Dennis and Graham Shellcross. Yeah, it's awesome. Cheers. Like this race car, it's just been something else. You, you spoke to us before coming back out on Christmas time saying you spent a lot of time on it, worked hard, got it to where you, you were really happy with it, and it's just been faultless since. Yeah, it's such a good car right now, so. It's just that easy to drive, especially on a track like this. So you can be consistent, like the whole race. So it makes it pretty, pretty easy going. Mate, congratulations! This was awesome. This was <laughs> one of those ones that you knew if you had the right car, you'd be there, and uh, you've done it, mate. Well done. Yeah, thank you. Cheers. Go on, Butterbuck, one more time. Make some noise. The Rum City Rumble Champion Feature Race winner for the Proddies. It's Brad Shearer. <laughs> <laughs>